And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Another mild night throughout Greater Lafayette, but at least it was a dry, nice day today. A little bit on the mild side. Temperatures were about a degree above average earlier on this afternoon. 85 degrees was your high temperature in Lafayette. Our average high for the beginning of August, 84. Right now, we find ourselves at 72 degrees. Winds are calm. Humidity is high. Now, visibility is still pretty much unlimited at this time in Lafayette, but I wouldn't be surprised to maybe see some light and patchy fog throughout the region as you kick off your morning commute for Tuesday morning. 73 degrees right now in Delphi. The same story in Remington. Crawfordsville, 73 as well. Seeing the primarily clear conditions for now, and it's all thanks to a core of high pressure that's slowly making its way in over the Great Lakes. Now centralized across parts of northern Michigan. This high will slowly depart eastward over the next 24 to 48 hours. And as that occurs, we can expect more cloud cover to move in as a round of weak low pressure swings in from parts of the Great Plains. Now centralized over parts of South Dakota. This low will actually swing southeastward towards parts of Iowa, western Illinois, and eventually south of Lafayette that may also bring the potential of some scattered rainfall back to the forecast as well. For at least tonight, we do stay dry. Scattered cloud cover continues throughout the overnight hours. Few light showers off to west, a possibility, but for the most part, we're going to be staying dry throughout the region. Temperatures fall off into the mid to low 60s. 64 degrees, your overnight low temperature in West Lafayette. We fall to 65 degrees in Crawfordsville early tomorrow morning. Olivia Percio setting in the beautiful backdrop this evening. Your snapshot forecast of last night's sunset. A gorgeous sunset throughout much of Greater Lafayette. A lot of pictures being sent in. Olivia setting in the very nice one behind us. 66 degrees early tomorrow morning. Warming back up to around 68 by 8. 76 degrees by 10 a.m. Scattered cloud cover throughout the morning. We should stay relatively dry throughout much of the day. Now, latest forecast miles indicating a slim chance for a couple isolated showers. So I kept about a 10% chance or coverage of maybe a few light showers tomorrow, but for the most part, it should be another dry day as this weak frontal boundary remains to the south of us. The low pressure to the west, keeping the majority of the rainfall away from us and high pressure still lingering off to the northeast, acting as kind of like a buffer, keeping a lot of the moisture, at least that excess moisture, away from us. So we're looking at a dry day tomorrow for the the most part, maybe a slim chance for an isolated shower or two, but a warmer one at that. 87 degrees or high temperature in West Lafayette for tomorrow afternoon. Heat and seas tomorrow could reach right around the low 90s, as high as about 92, 93 in Lafayette tomorrow afternoon. Now, we do warm back up to 89 on Wednesday. Thursday, guys, we're all the way back up to 90 degrees. That day, we could easily see, to he see a heat index near 100 degrees in Lafayette. A cold front swings across the Midwest on Friday. We'll at a high temperature, 89 that afternoon. The next day only reaching 83. Saturday actually looking like the gem of the forecast. Mostly sunny to partly cloudy. High temperature 83 degrees that afternoon. I feel like that's been the case here lately. As Saturdays have been really nice. They really have been. And, you know, we did see some scattered rainfall throughout the weekend here. But temperatures over the weekend were certainly comfortable. It's unfortunate that we see that 90 degree temperature move in just in time for the first week of August. Exactly. But that's August. Yes, it is. And what <laughs>